Now, I was explaining to y'all, y'all know I talk to y'all about how important nature is. Nature is so in the building. I talk to y'all about how important nature is. Y'all see me with all type of plants. I got nature in my room. You know what I'm saying? I got nature right here. I love nature. Nature got nature right there. Nature changed my life. Nature so in the building. Some of y'all don't understand without nature, we can't live. We can't survive without nature. At, more and more people are starting to be aware of these fake clouds, bro. Even my family, people are starting to notice, bro, what's up with them spraying all this smoky shit in the air? Even sleep bots is starting to notice. They probably don't know what exactly is going on. But like I fucking said, this channel was for anybody that always wonders some weird shit about this fucking reality that we live in. If you ever question anything, nine times out of ten, you are right. And that's why I'm bringing you these videos. To bring it to light. Something you already probably thought about. I'm just make. I'm putting it more and more. I'm, you was always right. You was never wrong. You wondering why they spraying... Ask yourself this. Why are they spraying chemically deadly clouds? And why are they destroying trees? What is they trying to accomplish? Without the trees, we can't survive. Without the sun that they are trying to block, they ain't even trying to block the sun no more. They just trying to... I say they trying to kill off as much people as possible. They trying to block our sun. They got deadly chemical clouds. They trying to destroy our nature. What is they trying to leave us with? We can't live without none of that shit. Certain people can't even live in certain areas because it's too harsh on their breath. I have females that came over here because I live damn near in the desert, bro. It's hot, man. It's scorching over here. Man, females come over here and say, like, man, it's like they be, it's hard to breathe around this shit, man. Them trees is what purifies the air. That's why y'all seen that Amazon rainforest shit trending, right? And I told y'all, bro, look what they doing. So look, at first it wasn't trending. The media, they run, these people that run the Matrix, they run the media. They choose, they decide what they want to promote. Normally it be fake shootings or some shit that keep you at a low vibration. They promote the fuck out of it. The whole world know about it. But when it's some shit that's killing us, some Amazon rainforest, something that's really happening that matters, they would never talk about it. They don't want you to know about it. Your favorite celebrities is not going to talk about it either. Remember I told y'all, go watch my video, These Rappers Must Be Stopped. I was talking about how the difference between woke celebrities and fake woke celebrities. Most of the celebrities is, is for the Matrix, bro. You got to understand, most of these motherfucking celebrities are clones. Nothing but matrix agendas. So look, they wasn't talking. What they wasn't talking about it, bro. Wasn't nobody talking about it. And then a few bigger Instagrammers and Twitter and on Twitter, people start retweeting it. It start getting out there more and more and more. So us people that's woke that seen what's going on, we started speaking up. We went against the media. We made it trend ourselves. The media still wasn't promoting it. Day go by. They still burning our shit down. Another day go by. They still, it was still burning. They still wasn't talking about it on the media, bro. They still wasn't talking about it on CNN. They was talking about everything but what was going on. Right? Now, for us that's woke, we just sitting there looking at these motherfuckers continuously losing the battle. The Matrix continuously doing every fucking thing in their power. To keep these people, to keep us at a low vibration, to keep us sick. We just sitting at them watching every move. We are 30 steps ahead of them. And they are always 30 steps ahead of us. This is they matrix. We just always prepared. Us that's woke, the chosen ones. So look. Days go by, right? It was still burning. It was getting no media coverage. Out of no fucking where. A cloud come and put the fire out. Nobody was talking about the cloud. The rain cloud came over the rainforest and put the... It came over the rainforest itself and put the fire out in the rainforest. Like Mother Earth did that shit herself. 
Nobody was, no media coverage. They never talked about it on none of the news, bro. It never made the news. I'm talking about the main news, CNN, Fox, um, bro, real shit. No, none of them talked about it, right? So out of nowhere, a rain cloud comes, Mother Earth. Y'all know Mother Earth is tired, bro. Mother Earth is sick and tired of these motherfuckers running this matrix. She gonna act a fool in a minute, bro. When you ain't connected with nature, when you connect with nature, you know all this shit. You getting this information. This information coming out of nowhere. It's like you waking up with a whole new brain. It's like you waking up parts of your brain that been asleep your entire life that they programmed to be asleep. You start know you start knowing everything. Everything. You will be like, bro, how do I even know this shit? So look, out of nowhere, the rain started putting out the fire. The more and more and more people start finding out about the rainforest, the more and more people start becoming aware of what was happening in the Amazon rainforest. When I tell you out of nowhere, next thing you know, this Popeye's chicken sandwich completely covered up everything that happened in the rainforest. And none of y'all motherfuckers even knew. All these sleep bots hop right for the bait. It is nothing spectacular about them GMO fake meat ass chicken sandwiches that y'all are eating. It is nothing spectacular about that shit but death. Yet, y'all completely forgot what happened in the Amazon rainforest. All them people that pass, all them animals that pass, all that nature that pass. And y'all don't care about none. All y'all care about is a fucking fake GMO. Y'all probably eating people. It get that fucking far to what they doing to us. And you, but y'all don't never take the time out to do y'all research because everything is good to you. It's good. Okay. 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 Y'all didn't know that was a distraction? That was a big ass distraction. That was just a bait for the fucking Matrix. They trended the fuck out of that Popeye shit, didn't it? It completely covered up the entire story about the Amazon rainforest, didn't it? Nobody talking about it's like it never happened. You see how the Matrix is? Motherfuckers would be mad and complaining one day and back on something else the next day. <laughs> it's time for us to escape the matrix, dog. It's time for us to escape the matrix. It's time for y'all to really, really start paying attention to how you feel. Take it some time out for what you do on a regular basis. And start looking at what's going on right in front of your eyes. Start looking up at the sky sometimes and see what's right above your head. See what you're breathing in. That shit is taking years off our life for people that's not taking care of themselves. It's taking years. We talk about stuff that's popping up in your... We talk about people ending up with these random diseases out of nowhere, bro. This is what the trees is for. That's what the, the rainforest is for, to purify the air for us. But it's people that still think that nature is nothing but decoration and trees. Man, if y'all don't get that fake nature out your house and get some real plants. <sighs> that Popeye's chicken sandwich shit was just a distraction for the, the Amazon rainforest. It completely covered up the entire story. That's what they wanted to happen. They didn't want none of us to know about that shit. It started trending because of people start speaking. It's a lot of woke people out here, man. It's a lot of people that care about nature and care about these animals. Man, a lot of animals pass, bro. A lot of animals. Man, that's like the motherfuckers burning up our city, man. Dead ass, bro. When you start connecting with nature, you start feeling sorry for the shit that's helping our people. And our animals. It's like us versus them. Y'all got to understand, if you start reading deeper and deeper into these Bibles, you will find out that these people, the motherfuckers running the Matrix, are the ones who made us eat animals. But only time will tell when your time come. You are the chosen one. If you're watching this video, I hope you know that. Your time will come. You're going you're gonna to have a conscious shift, and you're going to start wondering what is affecting you, bro. I went from a depressed nigga with all the clout in the world 
to only happy serving my purpose. Nothing else makes me happy. New shit don't even excite me no more if I'm not helping nobody. I get excitement from people saying that I help change their life, not from people saying that I intervene.